Hi, my name is Graham Morgan Watson. I'm one of the contemporary Horsham artists, part of a group that's uh, based in West Sussex, Horsham, West Sussex in England. And I'd like to talk to you about one of my paintings, uh, one of my own piece of art, because it's not just paint I'm using on this particular one. This one, this particular picture is called Soaring. It was based on a picture I saw of a sea eagle. Now, sea eagles normally white, but in the art world we can do what we want really and I played this gold I just felt it sort of wanted to make a statement and the feature particularly about this painting this particular piece of work is that it's a, a 3d wall painting in that it's not just a flat painting I quite like the idea of creating something which is a tactile um, and also that you get some different uh, aspects as you move around the room so I'm going to move the camera. As we get closer, you can see that actually it is a 3D model, in most part, attached to the canvas. I'll show you partly how that was, uh, or what it was I did for that. But as you can see, it's not all lifting away. The main leg and the tail, and of course the body. As you see, as you go around, as you would walk around the room, you see more of the bird in different ways. And then the wing on this side lifts away. The leading edge, as you can see, is lifted off the canvas. And then the wing tip, you get this little flare at the bottom top. But the other wing, being further back is painted. It has a texture, so it's still got some sense of lift. So that we have something which emerges from the canvas. Now some of the effects are also used on the uh, painting itself, the canvas side. You can see that we've got a crackle. It's a crackle product that you then paint on and in fact, it will continue to crackle whatever paint you put over it until you somehow seal it with a varnish. It lasts quite a long time. And then again, at the bottom here, we've got some crackle and we've also got some translucence coming from using a gel medium. And then again, a little bit more body and texture as the painting lifts. So you can see that it's really quite a tactile and very solid. This, is, this isn't anything that's soft. I mean, it was a it's stiffened canvas. I'll show you that in a second. So this is coming up this canvas like this. And it's sort of, it's not a plaster seam, but it's sort of clay. It would go hard if I didn't keep it in a bag. But you can mold it into a shape which was in this case was the body of the bird and the head and then cover it over with um, with the material covered in the parlor pole which is a stiffener so that's how i created this particular piece which i did a couple of years ago it's set in a mounted frame um what they call a a, 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 a I don't know the name's gone from the moment but it's um a deep frame with a gap around it and this is one of the pieces that would I would be showing at the art trail if we have one this year this particular video is done in 2020 when unfortunately the art trail for most artists have been cancelled we're hoping still to be able to uh, display at the art fair in October in Horsham but we won't know that until June uh, end of June but meanwhile, we're going to be putting together some little videos showing you some of the art. So thank you very much for watching this one. Do visit the website, www.horshamartist.org. And my name's Graham Morgan Watson. Thank you for watching.